Hello and welcome back to my RimWorld Let's Play series, where in this episode we are picking up exactly from where we left off in the last episode. In the last episode our caravan arrived at this location to save... Now I forgot to look up the name again, but Furnigen, I guess it is. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. Actually, I'll look it up myself, but um, <laughs> if I'm saying that wrong, sorry. But um, yes, we managed to rescue her and also recruit her. So right now I'm just waiting for them to, um, or for her to get healed enough so that they can walk, so that they can start heading back. Now at our main colony, we, well, we have an issue. We are currently on full lockdown because we have two animals that have that have gone mad um, and they are hunting us or them basically but what I did in the last episode I put the I blocked the doors for the cat and the turtle because I was afraid that they might attack them but I don't think so since it does say uh, there we go maddened manhunter so yeah Ooh, yes, perfect. Perfect timing. So I'm going to unforbid this, as I do believe they will then be able to eat food. So this one will consume, the turtle will consume grass. As you can see, it is really hungry. And this guy, um, his food is quite low as well, but he should be able to maybe, yeah, I don't know. He doesn't have access to O here, but maybe he will be able to catch a rat or something. But um, yes, the turtle is consuming dandelions, which is good. The cats should be able to hold out for a little bit longer, but I'm not sure how long. We'll take a look. We'll keep an eye on it. But that is basically what I'm waiting for. Crafter and Johnny are safe in here with obviously plenty of food and medical supplies. They shouldn't need any of it and they have some sleeping areas over here. Um, it is really annoying. I just want them to disappear. We also have a... Yeah, mad turkey over here. Oh wait, that's not it. Uh, where is it? There's a mad turkey around here somewhere. Well, I can't find it right now. Oh, is it this one? No. Maybe it's gone. I'm sure there was one. Anyways, it's a bit dangerous outside right now. So, they aren't going out. They will have to stay indoors just to be safe. So that is basically what I'm waiting with the most. And I'm also waiting for her to heal a little bit more so we can travel easier and faster and better. But we will have to do it fairly soon. All right, let's speed time up a bit. All right, I just got a warning that we have a minor break risk, which is, I believe, ah, okay. Let's see, experience acute pain, ate raw food, naked, feeling bad, disturbed sleep, slept on the ground, in darkness. I can understand that 100% this is not our permanent home, they even sleep here out in the rain. Um, so yeah, I think in the morning we'll get them to head back to, um, to well, our colony here. But um, yeah, that was just a really quick update. Now they're sleeping as well. We can speed time up a little bit faster. Go away, please. Soon. This is one of the reasons why I want turrets. Because, oh, is it leaving? I think it's leaving. Moving. Okay, so that's leaving. I think. But yeah, that's, as I was saying, that's one of the reasons why I want turrets. Because they can take care of this stuff. We don't have to hide, but of course we need the right research to do it, and I don't even know which research it is. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Okay, but that thing left. Okay, so this... Oh, wait a second. Okay. Let's just do normal speed. I think it turned to normal. Okay, I think it's safe to unforbid the doors. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay, so it's now morning. The cats should now be able to... Oh dear. It should be able to now go back and 
Uh, get some food. Okay, crafter. Wait. Equip your rifle. That was the mistake I made. Um, he currently has this steel equa. A short, what did it say? A short spear handle attached to a long bladed head. Basically, I thought it was a sniper rifle, but of course it wasn't. Okay. Okay, the threat seems to be gone. Which is good, because now we can continue with our normal lives. Okay, I wanted a door here. <laughs> and I also wanted some floors. Basically what I was doing before all this madness broke out. Um, I was making a new area for us to research and also craft stuff because I'm pretty sure I wanted to make a um, production uh, what is it? tailor bench so but we cannot make an electric one because we need parts so it'll have to be a hand tailor bench put it here um, yeah here there we go. The outdoors will be fixed, so that's good. That thing will be moved, installed over here. I don't want to keep this wall though, as it would seem fit that the guy researching needs as much peace and quiet as they can get. Okay, and what are you doing? Alrighty. So Johnny is harvesting our stuff here. Um, spoils in 13 days, spoils in 2 quadrums and 8 days. I don't know what quad quadrums are. I shall try and remember to look that up. <laughs> Alright. Okay, yes. World. Let's go to here. Zoom in. Okay. How bad is it? Severe. I think we'll have to because this raw meat won't last for long. So, okay, world, reform caravan, everyone, items, oh, freezing up here, there we go. Bring all the meat, bring all the leather, we will be able to use it, uh, wood, no, don't even fill with that, okay. So here, enter people of hope, so that travel, that should be... Uh, 1.1 days, even though they might not have enough food, they should have enough, I think. They shouldn't starve too much, hopefully. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay. Johnny? Uh, do you haul? No, you do not. That's why, then. Okay. But it is crafter's number two priority after doctor and cook and construct. Okay, what do you do? Refueling torch. We should probably get that out of here. Deconstruct. You know what? Uh, all that. <laughs> I don't want that to be refueled because I will deconstruct it. And well, I'll add some lights in here. That'll be better, I think. Okay. The problem with these things, the reason why we couldn't just melee attack it is basically because when they... At least when they get downed, I think it's when they die, but it might also be when they get down, downed. Um, they explode, but I think it's when they die, it would make more sense. And, well, cause a lot of fire, and since we have wood and stuff, and also they cause a lot of injury since it's melee attack. So that's not the best thing to do. Oh, out of saving. Alright, there we go. So yeah, we just had to wait that one out. I'm excited for when they return because Hurt and Gizaki, if you remember, they were going to have a marriage. Now I have no idea how to set up a marriage spot and I have tried researching it and I have not found anything. So I guess it'll just be whenever and wherever it does it. I don't know if it just goes after the most beautiful place, but let me tell you, the place is not that beautiful. We need someone to clean it. But Johnny is... um currently on growing so he's fixing the farm and everything so that's good he's farming and crafter is hauling everything into the refrigerator we do not even need to hunt with all this food we have insane amounts of food from this harvest up here and we still have 183 berries and plenty of rice 
and more berries on the way. Okay, forget that. <laughs> um, so yeah, we have plenty of stuff to survive with. Okay, how far are they? Eh, they are moving slow. But they should be there really soon. So in the next day or so, let's speed up time. All right. I do want Johnny to equip this though, just in case of an emergency. So if he goes to eat or something, I will ask him to equip this. But he's planting, so it's fine. We also have potatoes which are soon done as well. We also have some potatoes in the refrigerator, which is pretty cool. Let's speed time a bit more. There we go. What's this? Ooh, corn. Okay. That's nice. Okay. Oh, minor break risk. Who's that? Crafter. Why? Night Owl in daytime, that does a lot. In a little pain, slept on the ground. Yeah, that, that should be fixed now. <laughs> Feeling bad, um, impressive barrack. My barrack is impressive. Uh, oh, okay. He thinks this is in an entire room and he's like, uh, I have to share it. That is actually a thing I wanted to do. I wanted to expand these rooms here. Might not be able to expand it in that direction, but it will be able to expand it in this direction. So we will do that once, but we will do that once the other colonists return, because we will um, will need the man um, strength or the strength of more people to build this pretty fast, because everything has to be moved. The beds have to be um, moved, the plants, the lamps, the everything's, because the walls have to be extended. So that's a huge um, thing to do. I should probably also add more hospitals just in case. I guess there is room for one right here. I guess I'll do that at some point as well. Okay, let's put a uh, standing lamp. Let's put one right here to keep the area lit. One here as well. Alright, so they are now sleeping in their beds for once, which is pretty good. The beds are unowned. I'm not sure why. I think because the colonists are gone. Uh, okay, they should be here soon. Yes. They'll be here soon. I'm not happy that I can't designate a specific marriage spot, but I mean, it's just how it is, I suppose. What was that? Okay, I'm not sure, <laughs> to be honest. Okay, nice. We also need some lamps in here now. Okay, so, oh, furniture. What is the sun lamp? Lights an area brightly enough to grow crops, but consumes... Oh, hold up. Oh, no. Yes, our caravan is back. It's back. Okay. Um, wait, we should be able to fix that um, let's see health food poisoning oh no well it doesn't seem to be hurt like that like I think it'll pass we'll just have to keep an eye on it uh, I love animals. I hate when stuff happens. <laughs> okay, but our color color van caravan is now here, unloading inventory. Yeah, that's a good idea. And then take some clothes on. Okay, auto saving. That's good. Ooh, that's a lot of stuff to fiddle with. All right, cracking fingers. It's time. Okay, that was really delayed because I didn't really know what to say. Um, I'll just leave everything is. When I see something that I that needs to be done and it's not being done, I'll be sure to um, yeah, to fix it. <laughs> Cleaning. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Okay, so you're unloading your inventory. That's good. I don't know what she has on her. Oh, the mufflo leather. Okay, that's good. 
And what? No, she does not like crafter for some reason. I don't think many does, to be honest. Well, it's plus nine here. Well, he, on the other hand, doesn't like her either. <laughs> I guess it'll get um, developed. You know what? Take this on. It's not the best, but at least, well, take it on. <laughs> there we go. Yep, that's way better. Okay, now rest. And get some, get your strength back. All right. Hertha is straight to it with the hauling and the growing and everything. Sewing area, nice. Finally, Crafter can take a breather. <laughs> Him and Johnny have been working so hard at this place. Well, not really, they have been locked up, but um, still. Okay, standing left, the lights and area, people need to, people need light to move and work at full speed. Uh, this is normally used for crops, but I would love trying it here. It says, cons mm. you know what, let's try, let's put it in the middle of the room, like this. Let's just try it. We'll all, we can always deconstruct it if we want to. Okay, I'm not going to upgrade the rooms just now. Also, when they do get married, these two will need a... Well, they will basically have to share a room, so I guess... Mm, I feel like I want to make one of them extra big because they will be two, but I don't think that'll be necessary. I'll just make everyone, every bedroom big and then just plop two beds down, basically. All right, Huerta is cooking, what? Oh, okay, <laughs> I was like, wait, why is he doing the cooking? Actually, uh, yeah, that's, oh, that's Crafter, okay. Huerta is number two, hmm. Why on earth is he cooking? I don't mind, but, um, oh well, that's interesting. <laughs> okay, so she's resting, should get healed, or should be healed fairly soon. Um, does anyone here not have a weapon? Oh, okay. Kiseki gear, auto pistol, rifle, I know that revolver, short bow, uh, Johnny, okay, where's Johnny? I want everyone to have a weapon. Johnny, equip this. I know you're in the middle of harvesting, but I still want everyone to be armed Okay, okay, so she can then take this knife. How is her... The melee ain't perfect. Ain't. Melee ain't perfect, but um, it's fine. Uh, I'll put the research here up high because I think she's the one with the most intellectual. Kisaki, crafter, well everyone is to be honest. And research is important, but I, but she has an extra big passion for it. Well, hers has two. You know what? She will be able to do that. Ooh, researching. She's up and working. You know what? Take that, just in case. I want everyone to have. I don't want anything to happen again where I'm like, oh, I forgot to um, equip this on this person. So everyone, get a weapon, <laughs> and then go research. All right. That's good. Oh nice, they're working together. Awesome. Cool. We'll also have to expand these um, somehow. Also, I think I'll make it like double so it's mirrored. So we have two cells just in case. Also, in a, in a, in a, in a emergency, <laughs> I can always convert one of these for prisoners or the prisoner to medical. So that's always a good thing. I guess we should... You know what, I'm going to... Okay, I'm not going to move anything now. It's too, just too much stuff. I don't want to do it now. I'm going to put some plants in here as well, just so they think it's a bit nicer. Uh... Okay, you know what? Uninstall that. <laughs> I don't want it. Actually, can we deconstruct? 
deconstruct. There we go. I want the materials back. I don't know what it costs actually. If it's like, okay, it's just steel. But I still want that steel for other stuff. All right. So research. I want. Um, I think which one is it? Machining. Okay. So after that, auto doors is a nice one to have. Um. IEDs, I don't know what that is. Incendiary IEDs. I guess this might be the turrets, but I'm not sure. This is Motars. Um, but I guess this might be... But that goes from air conditioning. I don't know. We'll have to see once we get up here. Um, I'll probably research... Uh, hmm what goes on <laughs> let's see mm. powered armor nice well we'll have to see I guess I think I'll try research it whenever we can but I think gunsmithing motors and then IEDs will be a good one to get okay just one berry left <laughs> Or one bag of berries or box of berries. I don't know. All right, so far, so good. She's researching away. I love that. And, um, well, we will be able to make clothing, I think. We had Bill. Yeah, we can make clothes now because I do know that some of them do want to change like this. It's pretty normal, so he's good. She's good as well. She's good. Law wants something else. I'm pretty sure she wants something else as well. Johnny is okay, good. Just ignore the background noise. Neighbors, noisy. Um, so yeah. You know what? I think... Wow, that's the only note that we have here. Okay, awesome. Um, yes, I think I'm going to call it an episode here. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, remember to leave a like. Oh, wait a second. Hold up. <laughs> Uh, yes, we do have an extra bed for her. Okay, good. Sorry. <laughs> I was concerned that we only had, um, that she didn't have a bed reserved, but she does. One of these. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment and share with your friends, and if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe. And also, if you got any suggestions for the colony, like designs or room organizations or anything like that, be sure to let me know down in the comments below. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed. And have a nice day. Bye-bye.